The fifth installment of the Don't Hug Me musical series is making its St. Cloud premiere. Park. Don't Hug Me, We're Married takes us back to northern Minnesota in the town of Bunyan Bay. It's Fargo meets Bridesmaids without the wood chipper or the food poisoning. Writer Phil Olson says Gunnar and Clara Johnson are struggling with their marriage. Gunnar and Clara Johnson are owners of the tiny little bar. They've been married for a long time and the romance has left the marriage and Clara would like to get it back. And when Gunnar, her husband, sees the writing on the wall, when he finds a pamphlet that Clara was hiding for divorce fantasy camp, so he realizes at that point he needs uh, he needs to do something to convince his wife that he can pull it together. So they have a little competition who can be the better spouse. The show also follows the engagements of Bernice and Arvid and triggering Canute. So it looks like we're going to maybe have a double wedding, Arvid and Bernice and Trigger and Canute, possibly. Of course, everything is going to go wrong. It could possibly go wrong. And then the other question is, is Clara going to go to divorce fantasy camp? Is Gunnar going to pull it together and, and win back the love of his life? You know, rest assured, nothing will go as wedding planned in Bunyan Bay. The musical is full of laughter and 17 original songs. Songs like The Marriage Test is the name of one of the songs. My favorite, The Day That Bob Dylan Was Here. Bob Dylan came into the Bunyan one. The other songs, Lower Expectations, It's All Coming Together, We're All Gonna Die because it is a wedding and things could go wrong. Joshua Ackerman, WJON. Fans in the family, and Clara can pose a zipper. <laughs>